Williams to the baseline, missed the shot, rebound McGrady. Clippers will get the ball back as Stackhouse to McGrady. When the, knees, when the knees are good, then T Mac can still do that. If he's feeling okay and hot, uh, the Clippers shooting 71%, the Hawks 69%. What's the common nature of the. Uh, Reggie Evans got popped on that one. Uh, of the head coaches on the opposing teams against the Clippers in these three games. Not a bad idea to trap right there. Three in the clock. McGrady is another good defensive set for the Clippers. Free throw line. Foul's well, going to be called against Tracy McGrady. Only two shots for Blake Griffin so far. We're... Let me ask you a question about Tracy McGrady. Go ahead. Is he a Hall of Famer? Two-time scoring champ. Many-time All-Star. Two-time first-team All-NBA. Never an NBA champion. Is, it, is anyone in the Hall of Fame with those same credentials? I don't know. Go read Bill Simmons' book. Tell me. <laughs> that would take me a month. <laughs> Again. <laughs> um, I mean, he's close. He's right on the border, isn't he? Yep. And I loved him. I loved Tracy when he was younger. And oh, oh, gee, well. Blake just shot two, two, two free throws a foot short, both of them. I'm just throwing out names. No, those are actual people. McGrady inside. Swen Nader. No, no, no. A big, powerful center for the Knicks. Yeah. Undersized center. That Greg Kite? Like, Greg Kite? No, no. But does that fit the mold? No. no. This guy, I, I thought it was my greatest play-by-play -play call ever. Shoot up an air ball. And I said, this guy's capable of doing it two times in a row. <laughs> and, and he did? And he came up and did it again. <laughs> And I'm just, I've been patting myself on the back. That's 20 years ago, and I'm still doing it. That's doing your homework right there. <laughs> McGrady at the foul line. I did not expect that with uh, no. Blake Griffin. He made his first two tonight, uh, and, and his you, next two were all air. Yeah, and usually there's an adjustment, right? You, you miss short, you're going to squeeze a little. My theory was if you miss short, my theory was you could shoot it straight every time. You line your body up, you're just going to work on it, so you shoot it absolutely straight every time. And if you miss short, you squeeze your follow through just a hair more. Uh, and that would make up the inch or two that you usually need to, you know, get the extra. Remember years ago, working with Kevin Lockery, a longtime great NBA player and coach, he used to watch players shoot in warm ups. And he said the good shooters always are online. Yep. He said, if you get a guy that's shooting wide right or wide left, he's not a very good shooter. They're not going to be consistent. Yeah. You're absolutely right. McGrady from the corner misses it. Gets the rebound back. Good hustle by the old guy. Teague thought about it, did not pull the trigger. And, and believe it or not, while we're talking about free throws, well, Blake Griffin has 20 games. He's averaged almost four offensive caroms. His eight boards in this one. The lob, the jam. You mean T Mac can still do that? I don't, I don't think T Mac gets a whole bunch of those anymore. When people are saying. McGrady. Uh oh, Smith for three. Bingo. That is a five point game. That's the speed and the defense of this Clipper group. This is the all second unit again. Almost, oh, almost another. A T Mac for three. Six point game. 